It's going to be a great tasting, and I hope you get a chance to taste these wonderful wines. So thank you very much. Hey, everybody, come here. Everybody, put your hands together. Come on. Woo! Let's do it, both of them. Yeah. Yeah. Right now, I think everyone has the wine fever. How extreme that is depends on their time and disposable income. It's a real honor and a pleasure to have uh, Robert Parker in Hong Kong. The economic growth rate of China over the past 10 years has been the fastest in human history. China, including Hong Kong, has now become the largest importer of Bordeaux wines in the world. They just erupted, and we were afraid uh, of not being able to cope with such, such a fast change. I mean, we didn't know the country, and we didn't know the people, the culture. So we thought that it was very necessary to have somebody based there. Welcome to Beijing! We're very happy to sponsor one of the best events in China this year. And we are very, very happy to be there with so many beautiful girls. The idea was to promote the beauty of women in China and to promote the beauty of wine from France. So we did a kind of combination for the election last year of Miss China Universe in a very special party where the goal was to teach how to drink wine to 32 of the most beautiful women in China. Compared to France, where my generation is less excited by wine than before, you know, because it's, we had wine for hundreds of years. In China, it's very new. In some small cities in China, you arrived, there was a big red carpet. They bring two Rolls Royce to, to take care of you with hundreds of people on the side of the carpet. And you feel, well, am I uh, at the Cannes Film Festival or what? This is China getting excited by wine, getting obsessed in a way by wine because it's new, it's fun, it's French, and uh, we have so much potential in this market.